guys, today I am doing a Q and A. I've never actually really done one of these before. I was supposed to do this with Brown, but then we didn't actually get enough time to film because the lighting is going down and because the clocks have gone weird like ages ago. Um, it has been going really dark lately, so we didn't have enough time to film. And so it is now the next day, which I was supposed to film this yesterday, but no, we didn't. So basically, I'm filming this Q and A on my own. Basically, I will not be showing up the questions on the screen when you're watching this because basically, I got these questions off Tumblr. I did ask, um, I did ask across Instagram, Snapchat, and my brown ask across Twitter as well, but she hasn't given me the questions yet. So I will not be showing the questions up on screen, but I've just uh, screenshotted a load of questions which I thought would be really cool to do. So let's basically just get into the Q&A. This first question, this first question, which I was actually going to delete, but then I saw this and I thought, oh, it's so funny. It says, which Disney princesses, which Disney princess do you most identify with, and why? Ah. Um, and then, which is your favourite, and why? And yes, anyone can answer this question. Um, don't know why I read that bit. My favourite Disney princess is oh, I got two. Um, I think when I was my all-time Disney princess, it has to if it has to be princess, then it'd be Cinderella. But then I was gonna say Elsa, but she's not a Disney princess yet. She's a Disney princess in waiting. So I can't really say Elsa, but um, Cinderella is my most favourite uh, princess because I don't know. There's just something about her that I really like, and every time when I was younger, I always used to dress up as her and just do everything like as her because I just always used to love her really. So I think because when I was younger, I used to have blonde hair that um, I always thought, oh my god, I was Belle. Belle, no, Cinderella. Because I'm Cinderella and all that and that. And which Disney, most, which Disney princess would you most identify yourself with? And that would be Elsa. She has ice powers, <laughs> and you're probably gonna laugh at me because I'm not gonna know that. She has ice powers, and I've always, always, always wanted ice powers. Like, obviously, it's never gonna happen, but I've always just wanted ice powers. And I don't know, it's just something about it. Like, it's, she's just amazing. She, I think every kid out there is gonna say Elsa, but I think there's a couple of girls which are gonna say Anna, but I just love Elsa. And I love Marshmallow as well. If you don't know who Marshmallow is in Frozen, um, it's basically the big monster that um, Elsa makes. And if you watch it, you can realise that Olaf says, hey guys, we, we definitely lost lost Marshmallow back there. So, his name is Marshmallow. Tried to Google it and it kind of got it out like, yeah. Next question is, what is your favourite colour? Hmm, let me think. I think my favourite colour has to be blue. Um, my whole room is blue. I even have a calendar. Um, I do have a calendar now, blue. And it is January is blue on it, so I was quite happy about that. Because <laughs> it kind of blends in with my wall. Which is quite funny. What is your favourite animal? Oh, that's quite hard because I love every animal except for cats. Like, I love tigers and all that. It's just pet cats. I don't know, I have a stone like them. Favourite animal? I know one of my friends are going to be shouting this at the uh, screen right now. Dogs. Dogs are my favourite animal. I just, oh my gosh, dogs are my life. I've always wanted a dog, but just never got one. But when I move out, I'm getting one. I'm getting a dog. My favourite breed would have to be a Rottweiler. Because, I don't know, there's just something about Rottweilers, but they have like a bad name. But in the food as well, though, um, you can, throughout time, you can change that name about them dogs. Like, I know so many Rottweilers who are really nice and kind, and it's just rude that people give it a bad name because they are vicious, but I think it's as well, though. They can be nice. Yeah, a bit of science, but not science, but you know. What is your favourite television show? Oh! I've got a load. I'm trying to think of my top one because if it was your favourite YouTuber, I've got a load. Um, I don't really watch TV that much. I mainly watch Netflix and YouTube. Um, I think my favourite TV show, TV show would have to be. Uh, no, I've got two. It, oh, three, two, three, two. I've got three. It is Miranda, Mrs. Brown's Boys, and EastEnders. They are my all-time favourites. But Mrs. Brown's Boys is hilarious. Miranda stops. So I'm sad about that. But you know, EastEnders still going. 
I just wonder who killed Lucy, to be honest. I've given up. I just want Ronnie to wake up. Ronnie's had so much, like, disappointment in her life. She just needs a bit of uplift. But then, uh, shocker to all you guys, if you have not read the magazines, Ronnie dies. So I'm really sorry about the, yeah, little there. <laughs> um, what is your favourite food? I know Brown's going to be shouting this at the screen. Um, my favourite food... Uh, my favourite food would have to be ice cream. I know it's not food, but I know it's a dessert, but ice cream which is mint chocolate chip ice cream and it's Iceland's one which I do truly love and yeah um, I think it was like Friday night me and Brown we bought a tub we bought a tub each and we ate it all in that night <laughs> and we're supposed to be both on a diet so you know she every time when she comes around every time when she comes around tonight we always just feed her up so yeah kind of <laughs> we're, we're very like normal what is your favourite style of clothes my style of clothes is, I don't know, I like a range of clothes, but uh, the clothes I do, which I have like a load of tops like these, like these kind of tops, like a tank top, but I don't know, um, I load like basically like jeans and I like to have like sleeveless kind of tops a lot, like just sleeveless tops like this and I've got one on the floor actually. <laughs> tops like these where they... It's kind of inside out right now, but no tops like these where it's just I think it's just a tank top really, but it's like this, and then when you and then when you're out, like it's got this little round bit at the bottom, so then it covers like your, it covers your bum a bit. So I, I really like that kind of style with jeans and boots. Oh, I'm into boots right now. Yes, I oh, am. Yeah. Oh my god. What what's one of your favourite memories? Mm, my favourite memory. I think now. My favourite memory would have to be. I'm trying to think. So I've got a load of memories that I love, but I'm just trying to think of the main one. I know there's two memories that I really like. Um, I'm just going to say my two favourite memories. Um, my my first favourite memory is. Um, when me, me and my two friends, so me, Sarah, Brownie, and Alessandra, we were sitting in the diner at school and we could not stop laughing. We were laughing throughout lunch and then we, when we realised that we were still eating our lunch, that everybody was gone and it was, we were just cracking up and it was just, I had like a really, really that was in like year seven I think, we had like this, or I had this really weird laugh and I just could not stop, oh my god, it was so funny, it was just amazing. My second favourite memory is when I went camping, camping and caravanning with Brownie. We had an amazing time, camping and caravanning was quite fun, because normally when we, like, when we're with each other we normally like argue a bit but then on the camping holiday we did not and it was quite fun i think we argued just a couple of times so like it was just a bit just like oh my god just get out just get out before you will it wasn't like oh my god i'm like like we had like a massive fight it was just a bit of like just like get out before i kill you like just, just get out just, but it was quite funny but yeah my camping memory was quite fun um what's your favorite piece of literature no clue. What is your favourite film? Oh, that's probably hard. I have a load of favourite films. I think my first one would have to be Frozen. Second one would have to be Thoughts and Our Stars. Third would have to be Hash Training Dragon 1 and 2. And then fourth would have to be 21 and 22 Jump Street. And Mrs. Brown's Boys the movie. I can't pick, but my favourite film would have to be, my all time favourite film would have to be Frozen. Okay. Yeah. Frozen. <laughs> What's your favourite music genre? Pop. Pop. What's your favourite flower? My favourite flower? Oh, I don't know what it's called. Another. What's your name? What's your name? My name is Nicole. My channel is called Teddy Hughes. My nickname is Teddy. So I put it as Teddy. It's supposed to be Cherry Berries. I've got a load of nicknames. Like I've got, I've got Nick, Teddy, Cherry, Bob, 
crazy. But um, it, my actual name is called Nicole. It's Nicole Hughes, basically. What horoscope? What? Oh, what's your horoscope sign? Mine is a Leo because I was born in August. What's your biggest regret so far? My biggest regret so far is not. I'm trying to make this. I don't know. My biggest regret so far is not getting. Is no, can I just be honest? I don't really have a big regret. Oh yeah. My biggest regret is losing all my friends who who like losing all my friends who I loved and they've moved away or they've forgotten about me because they got new friends. But that's my biggest regret, like losing all my friends. And I do not keep in contact with them a lot, so I do regret that. What's your favourite video game? If you play, I don't play. What is your dream in life? My dream in life is to have a successful YouTube channel and to be a hairdresser and get a boyfriend. But yeah, my main one is to be to have a successful YouTube career. Maybe I'm quite random. Mm. Mm. Have you, no? Do you wear glasses? No. Have you ever been kissed by someone outside your family? This one's quite personal. Um, I ain't gonna answer that one. Do you hate anybody? Oh, fuck a load. What are two hobbies? YouTube and Netflix. Do you respond? How do you respond to hate online? Basically, if anybody's hating on you, just don't let them, don't reply to them. Don't let them bring you down because who you are is amazing so don't let the hate bring you down and can I just say Taylor Swift hate the haters okay like what was it like block out the haters all right from Taylor Swift I that's like block out the haters or hate the haters I don't know I go on a but all I know is just like block out the haters really just if someone's like commented or put a really mad, a mean comment just Delete that comment and carry on with your life. Just don't, but oh no, delete that and think of happy thoughts. And look at all the other like positive comments and views that you get. Got, got, got. Do you wish I had more followers? Yes, I do. I wish I had more subscribers because I do have nine subscribers and I wish I had more. Have you ever been bullied? Hmm. I have been bullied. I have been bullied because of my weight and. Yeah, I've been bullied because of my weight because I was when I was younger I was big and I'm still big now. But the thing is whether if you're big, be big. That's who you are. Like don't let anybody change you because of that. I went through a rough time when I was getting bullied, but then the thing is as well though, um, my friends were there by my side and I just I didn't really talk about it to anybody except for my friends. So basically I just kind of put in the side and thought of the positive things in life. Do you have do you own a television? Yes I do. <laughs> Are you from Earth? Okay, this is getting random now. Most embarrassing moment. Oh, this is funny. My most my most embarrassing moment is when I was in the high street with with Brown with Brownie and this music come on. I started dancing. And this boy I liked, I just say I liked, walked past me and filmed me dancing in the street. I got humiliated for everything. When I went to school, I got humiliated, but I just went, yeah, that's what I do. You don't like it, goodbye. Simple. There's the door. Simple. Okay. What are trolls? I don't understand what trolls are. Do you care about grammar? Not really, but you know. Who's your favourite artist? I ain't really got an artist. Dude, would you date me? Well, I don't know. Like, to be honest, would I date myself? Hmm, let me think. No. Hmm. I probably would. I, I, think, I think I'd have a while of time, because I'm quite mental. I don't know. Do you like to party party? Yes, I do. What is something weird you can do with your body that some others can't? I have no clue. <laughs> you know what? 
I'm going to leave them because they're quite random ones. There is a subtle one which many people have asked me, am I single? I am single. Yes, I am single and I am free and I'm happy. I'm happy being single. Yes, single Pringle. Some people are telling me that single Pringle means someone else. I'm just like, I don't know. I'm a single Pringle. Such a sad eyes. This is why I'm single because I go dancing down the street. <clears throat> I go dancing down the street, I go singing down the street, and I sit here with the, I start filming it, you know. Yeah, I start walking out and looking at my phone, like filming and stuff, like, whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, quite, yeah, random. My friends are gonna be like laughing at themselves at the moment. I am single. Um, there is another question. How did you deal with, a, with your breakup, or have you ever had a breakup? I, I got broken up a while ago, and I really did like this guy. Um, I don't know. Dealing with the breakup, like, it did hit me hard, but then the things were well, like, I had Brown there with me, so I kept like snapping her, texting her, and she was there, and she was like, love, love, look, 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 look at the positives. Get to spend more time with me. <laughs> just like, you're not helping. And what I did was I just thought, thinking about us, thinking this is the time that I can be me, I can do more stuff with me, and I get to spend more time with my friends. And I was ha like, I was happier, but the things were though like, I was not in a good relationship. Um, it was long distance, so it is. It was alright because it was kind of long distance a bit. Um, he was very controlling um, as well. I wasn't allowed to go and see Brown a lot. He said, "No, you got to spend it with me." But the things were like, it was good because I was long distance, and it was just a bit better that it was long distance for me. Um, but I, like, he never knew what I was doing because I was with Brown and I just never kept him a lot and it was just a bit, just a bit, and he was very controlling but I got over it and I'm really happy now, I'm happy that I'm single, I'm with my best friends and I love life, I've got YouTube, I've got Netflix, I've got ice cream, they're my boyfriends, I've got my bed, I'm happy, I'm happy, single and free, if you're single out there, embrace it, but like, I'm single and that hurts. <laughs> like I'm single and I'm loving it because you no, know you just gotta you should say it. Yes. Just listen to like a load of like fun songs. I watch romantic films a lot. This is what I stop crying at it because I'm just like I'm so single. It's what I'm just like I'm single. Not mad me. Because like, I can watch these romantic films and I have a double bed as well. So things as well though, like when you like when you like boyfriends stay time, you have to like cuddle up together and I I am one of them people who don't like being touched that much. And I'm just a bit like oh, God, God. that's quite random. <laughs> so then like I can just do this in my bed. I'm just like freedom. <laughs> I'm so so random. I don't think I'm ever gonna find a boyfriend really. And then my friends always say to me, they're just like, you're gonna find someone. You're gonna find someone who likes your who likes your weirdness. And I'm just like, love, you can't even deal with me. <laughs> How is my life? <laughs> I think I've been tired for too long now. I like I laughed myself a lot. Have you ever done that where you're in your class, you're in your school, and like, you like sit in there, or you're on a bus and it's like really quiet, and you're looking at your phone, and it's like your friend sends you like a this really random text, and you start laughing to yourself like really random. Everywhere it turns out, it's like <laughs> just like something. Oh my god, that's happened to me so many times. That that's one of my most embarrassing moments where Brown texts me something and I could not stop laughing. It was so funny. So <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. I've enjoyed filming it. I like doing these kind of things because I feel like it makes me more happy and I love like a lot. There's a cat on the wall. Really cat. Um, it just makes me more happy because I get to talk to you guys and I feel like more like getting in like more I feel like you guys get to know more about me and I am very happy and like I can just laugh a lot in these videos which I find is hilarious because I just start laughing to myself and I know my family's like outside my room with my door thinking what the heck <laughs> is she doing like laughing to myself so I hope you guys enjoyed this video today, please give it a massive thumbs up and a comment down below and please subscribe to my channel because there will be more super funny videos like this soon, yeah, yeah, I'm going to go make my coffee and I'm going to go, I don't know what I'm actually doing today, 
I'm just gonna die. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 